Steve Moscato is a great major. No means of measure can define his limitless love. He is enduringly strong. He is entirely sincere. He is eternally steadfast. He is imperially powerful. He is mortally graceful. He is impartially merciful. Do you know him? He is the greatest phenomenon that has ever crossed the threshold of Tustin Ranch. He blesses the young. He serves the unfortunate. He regards the aged. He rewards the diligent. He beautifies the meager. I wonder, do you know him? He's invincible. He's irresistible. You can't get him out of your mind. You can't live with him, and you can't live without him. THQ couldn't stand him. DHQ found they couldn't stop him. Michelle Escano couldn't find any fault with him. Core Council couldn't kill him. The advisory board couldn't candle him. The Tustin Ranch Corps couldn't hold on to him. That's our Lee Lascano. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, Major Lee Lascano. Is it still plugged in? Where's Barbara Davenport when our Anita? <laughs> hey, well, good evening to my 20 sumpth core, what, core, core retreat, right? How's everybody doing tonight? Everybody doing good? Does everybody have a fun day? What was your favorite part of today? Catching frogs. Jim Tripp Bill Cox didn't announce that today. When were you doing that? Race cars, okay, that's better. He did announce that. Well, I just wanted to welcome you. I just wanted to thank you for being here. We're going to have a marvelous time tonight. We have a whole thing. Hold on a second. You figured with LASIK, you know, it would have worked a little bit better, but you know, who knows the, the Salvation Army paid for the surgery anyway. So. <laughs> Sorry about that. It's good. All right, we're ready to have fun tonight. We got a whole thing lined up tonight. We're going to have the kids performing. We're going to have the youth performing. We're going to have adults performing. We're going to have the elderly performing. We're going to have some dancing. We're going to have some skits. We're just going to have an amazing time tonight. So I just want to let you know what was going on. Now, I just have one question. Is anybody here tonight because of the radio ministry? Would you please raise your hand? <laughs> anybody? That's, that's a little awkward. Okay, well, what I would like to start the night with, with um, would everybody stand up? I just want you to greet your neighbor. I want to bring a little bit of Tustin Ranch to the evening. Five, four, three, two... One. All right, could you sit down? Okay. Was that enough time to get to know anybody? Okay, you can stand one more time. I'll give you a little bit more time this time. Okay, stand up. Everybody up on your feet. Shake the hand to somebody that you don't know. Six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, please take a seat. Okay, just, I, I don't want to forget this. Judy, where are you? Judy, are you here? Judy. Oh, she's that at her table. Oh, are you? Okay, will you make sure to sign yourself up for like a penmanship or calligraphy, calligraphy course so you can practice the signature of the next major that comes into town so when you're sitting out the letters, it still looks pretty legit? You've done a good job. All right, well, like I said, I wanted to bring a little bit of Tustin Ranch home tonight. 
We've had a very nice weekend, and I just kind of wanted to do something different. So what we're going to do is we're going to have, there's a beautiful couple that have come to town that have joined us. I don't know if some of you guys have met them, but we're actually going to do a baby dedication tonight. <laughs> so could I actually have the flag bearers come down and grab the flags for me? Thank you. I see you. Everybody knows Ian and Warren. Thank you, guys. I really appreciate it. Ian and Warren. And now, if you guys can just welcome, please give a big Tustin Ranch core retreat welcome to our beautiful couple. We have uh, Dennis Royd. Dennis, would you please come out? Where are you? Are you up there? Okay. This is Dennis. Everybody welcome him, please. And where's your beautiful bride, Dennis? Dinner didn't agree with her. Well, where is she? She's in the bathroom still. Can you get it, please? Oh, wow. <laughs> this is Hamina. Hem. Do you go by him? Yeah. Hemroid and, and Dennis Royd? And what's this beautiful girl's name? Astro. Astroid. <laughs> it's a family name. It, it's, it's a beautiful name. You have some toilet paper. You have some toilet paper. <laughs> Preacher man. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Do you guys know what it means to be parents? Actually, it looks like you're already barefoot and pregnant to begin with. So. Is this your first? Okay. Well, welcome. Well. I just, do you know what it means to be a mom and a dad? <laughs> it means to, to do everything that you can to raise this child. Are you guys ready to hand the baby over to me? Because I would actually like to receive the child. Yes, I was Okay. I will receive the child. <laughs> Everybody look at Astrid. She's beautiful. She looks nothing like her mom. Okay. Do you guys promise to provide everything that this child needs? Yes. Electrolysis if necessary. <laughs> Multiple waxings if it's necessary. Um, some kind of femininity course. Do you guys promise? Oh, she stops stealing some razors. <laughs> All righty. Well, I will actually hand the baby back to you. In this church, in this core, we have a tradition. And normally what we do is we provide the family with a beautiful quilt that kind of describes the future, the aspirations, the hopes, the dreams of this child. We, you know, embroider the name of the child on there. And it's just, it's a beautiful symbol. So I... I Forgot it, actually. But what I had in my car was a beautiful chamois. It was a sham wow. And I actually, I was, I was thinking about today. I was reminded that this child um, will probably wash cars in the future. Um, will probably help clean things. Maybe get its hands very dirty, very messy. Um, it's actually good to kind of clean off, you know, shower, shaving cream. Thank you. Um, so I would actually like to present this with... Uh, actually, I forgot to put the name on. Hold on. <laughs> I would like to present this to the two of you. 
So can we please give a warm Tess and Ranch welcome to this beautiful couple? Thank you, gentlemen. <laughs>